This story is about a tiger which comes to tea. Once there was a little girl called Sophie and she was having tea with a mummy in the kitchen. Suddenly there was a ring on the door. Sophie's mummy said, oh I wonder who that can be. It can't be the milkman because he came this morning. And it can't be the boy from the grocer's because this isn't the day he comes. And it can't be Daddy, because he's got a key. We'd better open the door and see. Sophie opened the door and there was a big furry stripy tiger. And the tiger said, excuse me, but I'm very hungry. Do you think I could have tea with you? Sophie's mummy said, um, <laughs> yeah, of course, come in. So the tiger came into the kitchen and sat down at the table. Sophie's mummy said, well, um, would you like a sandwich? But the tiger didn't just, just take one sandwich. He took the whole plate of sandwiches and swallowed them in one big mouthful. And then he still looked hungry. So Sophie offered him the buns. But again, the tiger didn't eat just one bun. He ate the, all the buns on the dish. And then he ate all the biscuits and all the cake until there was nothing left on the table. Sophie's mummy said, um, would you like a, a drink? And the tiger drank all the milk in the milk jug and all the tea in the teapot. Then he looked around the kitchen to see what else he could find. He ate the supper that was cooking in the saucepans and all the food in the fridge and all the packets in the tins in the cupboard. He drank all the milk and all the orange juice g -g 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 and all Daddy's beer and all the water in the tap. Um, then he said, Oh, thank you for my nice tea. I think I'd better go now. And he went. Sophie's mum said, Oh, I don't know what to do. I've got nothing for Daddy's supper. The tiger has eaten it all. Sophie found that she couldn't have her bath because the tiger drunk all the water in the tap. Just then, Sophie's daddy's daddy came home. So Sophie and her mummy told him what had happened and how the tiger had eaten all the food and drunk all the drink. Sophie's daddy said, oh, I know what we'll do. I've got a very good idea. We'll put on your coats and go to the cafe. So they went out in the dark and all the street lamps were lit and all the cars and all their lights on and they walked down the road to the cafe. They had a lovely supper with sausages, chips and ice cream. In the morning, Sophie and her mummy went shopping and they bought lots more things to eat. And they also bought a tin of tiger food in case the tiger should come to tea again. Well, he might. Who knows? <laughs> Goodbye.